the Godfather movies. It's the same fascination in a way that we have with the Sopranos. It's uh, it's it's the humanization of someone who conventionally and from a cliche point of view isn't worth humanizing, and it's the virtue in avoidance of cliche. You, you, you don't accept, you don't take for granted anything. Godfather films are based on not taking anything for granted. Uh, I'll show you a man, now he does this, yep, he kept to kill people, but here's who he is, and here's what he thinks, and here's when he cries, and here's when he's unhappy or whatever. And, and it takes you into the persona of these people. And it all, you also have a feeling that you're looking at, um, at America, at a real cross-section of America with it. And I don't know how you define what makes something transcend itself, but, but it does transcend itself. It's so powerful, that piece. When you finished it, You've, you've, you feel like you've lived through five other worlds and other lifetimes, and you're in a whole other place when you walk out of the theater.